Now, I think it was 2015. I want to say in between 2013, 2015. It was me, my sister, and my mom. It was all the tennis court. Cause we used to play that just to get some exercise or whatever, just to get out of the house. And as my mom was practicing over there in the court, we was we was young too. So we, you know how young people would, you know, kids would play in the dirt or whatever. So we would play in the dirt, throw dirt at each other, and I and we both got our shoes messed up. And at that moment, you know, I was your boy was the best shoe cleaner in the world. So as I was cleaning my shoe in the bathroom, cleaning my shoe, she came in. She was like, "Malika, can you, can you clean my shoe?" I was like, "All right, bet." Now I'm cleaning her shoe, and I don't know why, but this was in my mind. If somebody walks in, which will be a dude, if a dude walks in, I'm gonna have to run and act like I'm using the bathroom, so he won't be weirded out by me. You know, he'd be like, I don't know what's going through my mind at that moment, but all of a sudden. I hear the door crack and my heart stopped just completely stopped and I look up no you know what no I didn't look up I just ran to the stall and act like I was using the bathroom and my sister just sitting there like what are, what are you doing and so and whoever walked in it was my mom my mom walked in she was like she like busting the door too like all right Doom, what y'all doing in here? And I, bruh, like I almost peed on myself for real, for real. And my sister looking confused. I'm confused and scared. And I look back, I am, I'm just in a stall, just hmm, turn around and I see a tennis racket. Yep. She had a whole, you know how you have that the skirt with the tennis outfit and whatever, like um, Serena Williams? Yeah, she had that. She had no belt. So the closest thing she could find us to hit us with was a tennis racket. So she beat me with a tennis racket. Yep. And my sister. She beat my sister for no reason. I don't know why. Then my sister was mad at me because she was like, The only reason we got in trouble is because of you. And I was like, the moment in my mind, I was like, dang, my fault. And then out loud, I was like, no, it wasn't. It was you because you went in the boys' bathroom. Because at first, I was like, I'm not going. I'm not going in the girls' bathroom. That's that's a fact. And then you gonna come in here with me, or you ain't gonna get your, your shoes clean at all. So some time passed, and she was like, Get over here and sit down. So went over to the bench. We sat down. Then, no, I, you know I had a little money on me at the moment. Then I was like, Psst. at the moment I called her Maya or whatever. So I was like, Psst, Maya, I bet you five dollars you wanna go over there and run in that dirt. She was like, Let me see the money. I showed her the money, handed it to her. She ran over there in the dirt. And all I did is sat back and watched. My mom got mad. She walked over there. She was like, Jemiah, didn't I tell you not to get in that dirt? And I was like, so did. Told both of us. Mm. And then I hear this. Malachi told me to. Look, look, look. He gave me five dollars to do it. And I was like, oh. And in my mind, I was like, wait, she don't know I got the five dollars, so how she know I gave it to her? Then the other side of my mom is like, yeah, I forgot. She gave the money to me, so she know I got the money. Uh, then we both got a whooping by the tennis racket. Again. And I was like, man, I ain't never playing tennis ever again. You know how you don't talk for talk to somebody for a very long time then about three minutes pass and you're like so you want you want to go play or something you know how you try to be friends again or whatever that's how me and my sister was we was like on and off brother and sister like or we used to be like i wish you was never my sister well i wish you was dead or i wish you got ran over or i wish you jumped off the plane well like so much stuff it was like oh my god when we went mad at each other it was like almost two days then I got lonely because I had no friends. So I was like, Maya, can you do this? Can you do that? Do you want to do this? And she would ignore me. And I was like, huh. So who I'm going to play with? Then I, some, time, then some time passed. And we became friends again out of that situation. But well, we would fight all the time. We would throw chairs at each other. We would tell on each other of every little thing. 
Then the other side, we would keep secrets to each other. We would close it now. Now, 2018, now, we like, like, close, 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 close. Knowing that she live in Columbus, and I live in Atlanta, it's kind of, kind of weird, but I do still talk to her from now and again, just to see what's happening down there. Cause, and that is the end of my storytelling. So if you guys enjoyed this video, I want you to smash that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already to join an upcoming Best Family on YouTube. The Savage Squad. And comment down below if you want me to do another one of these or a different type of video. And I see you in the next video because I'm a YouTuber.